Oh, so the issue with the leaderboard thing here was that I had this as last created leaderboard. That was a pretty dumb mistake. Should be killboard. There we go. And then change this, change this back to just be, uh, oops, just be killing player. And hopefully this will fix all of our problems. All right, I'm gonna choose the star team this time, and start building. And that's all I can build. And that was a bit quick. The timer should be a bit longer, I think. Alright, the kills are working now. And I'm going to upgrade this one. And upgrade this one. There we go. And I can sell this too, hopefully for the right amount. If I set the repair resource properly, which I think I did. Um, let's see how the wave 2 goes now that I have these guys. And you can see that this their turret actually moves too because I did that setting in the data editor. Their thing actually moves where they're targeting. It's kind of minor, but it looks cool. And I lost a lot of lives. Oh boy, I better maze a bit. Um, so that pretty much concludes this tutorial. Um, I hope it helps people a lot. This is a lot more complete than my simple tower defense, and I'm a lot more advanced now uh, since that last thing. Um, anyways, so that should cover this. And I one thing I think actually is that um, uh, for my builder, I didn't actually set the movement to be flying um, because he can't go through these things. So one thing you'd want to do actually is go to your data editor and find your star builder or whatever and make sure that his movement mover whatever where is it oh I did set it to fly um, it obviously wasn't uh, treating it like that but I think if you change change some more things around here it should uh, should fix that collide I think you have to set this to nothing and now it should uh, should be able to walk up cliffs and stuff like that. So anyways, uh, thanks for watching, and I hope this tutorial was enjoyed.